from howtoelectronics.com and in today's video we will be measuring the speed of this fan that is we will be designing a tachometer using IR sensor and Arduino that we will be measuring the speed of a fan in RPM that is revolution per minute for this we need following components Arduino Uno board we need IR sensor with IR LED and photodiode and similarly we need 16 into 2 LCD display for displaying the RPM so this is the circuit diagram we have connected the output pin of IR sensor to digital pin 2 of Arduino and similarly LCD is connected to pin number 13 12 11 10 9 8 and we are supplying 5 volt power and this is how we have assembled the same circuit on breadboard so we have LCD display and we have a IR sensor that contains LM358 IC now this is the fan which speed we are going to measure this fan has three blades so I have programmed according to the three blades you need to modify the program if you want to change the number of blade so currently when power is supplied it will be displaying 0 rpm now we will be supplying the power to the fan this is a 12 volt fan so now you can see it is displaying 10,000-13,000 rpm so the fan is rotating continuously and the revolution per minute is displayed on 16 to 2 LCD so now when I place my hand in front of a IR sensor so 0 rpm will be displayed so this is how you can measure the speed of a fan using IR sensor now I have stopped the fan so as soon as the fan is stopped you can see the speed is going down and now it has become 0 rpm this is a program we have defined float revolution rpm all time and time and isr is interrupt service routine that is used by ir led so this is how we are using the interrupt for rising and measuring the rotation this command detaches the interrupts and we are measuring the time in millisecond so this is the formula current time minus old time now you can see rpm value is equal to revolution divided by time into 6000 divided by 3 so this 3 is the number of blade change the factor according to the number of blade in your phone now old time is equal to mills that saves the current time and similarly the revolutions becomes zero now this is the program now simply compile the code and once the compilation is done upload the code thanks for watching for more visit my official website www.howtoelectronics.com